Hi YouTubers, it's Dave here from Geeky Bricks and the Webs channel. Um, so this is a, another video in my series of building my Lego room. So this week we start to seriously start to see some real progress, and uh, hopefully you'll agree with me. Things are starting to look uh, pretty good. Um, so from my point of view, it get very exciting because I'm gonna soon have a fairly large room to build my Lego city. Um, and also sort a lot of this mess out that is uh, behind me um, on various racks and shelvings. Um, but anyway, yeah, so what we're going to show you first is a time lapse of Saturday the 3rd of September. Today's Sunday, so on Saturday we spent quite, well most of the day probably, um, putting together the framework for the Lego room and then today we've only spent probably about two hours or so uh, mainly putting in the roof joists etc so time lapse to start with for Saturday and then we will take a look at Sunday there to show you some of the progress we did have to cut the time that short because it did actually start to rain uh, in fact yesterday on saturday it really did pour it down um towards the end but we uh still stuck it out and uh, got to where we needed to be so that we only had the roof um joists to put in um today being sunday so hopefully this will work but we're going to do a bit of a time lapse now for sunday not much on sunday like i said so it'll be a lot shorter time lapse um and then we'll actually look in, um, I guess, real time with regards to the progress that we've made over the course of this weekend. So over to the time lapse now. as you can see my garden there behind me and here around about there you can hopefully see the bones let's call it of the uh, Lego room um, coming together very nice now because I'm really pleased with the progress we've managed to make this weekend so we're going to go up there now uh, take a bit of a closer look really um, and then kind of an update really with regards to what's going to come next weekend so let's take a look now 
Okay everyone, so here we are up at the rear of my garden. Um, trying to get the whole of this Lego room in. Uh, it is quite big, so I'm obviously a few feet away from it at the moment. Um, but there you can see all the framework um, pretty much completed. Um, and those joists across what's going to be the roof stroke ceiling um, of the Lego room itself. Obviously this big gap here is where the double doors are going to be um, to get inside the lego room so you have to bear with me because as i get closer it's going to put things out of perspective but we will take a bit of a closer look now um, so just to explain here you'll see there are some overhangs that's because i am going to have an overhanging section there obviously will be some shelter and i'm going to put some lights in that little bit as well so this is if we were going in now through our double doors yeah hopefully again we'll start to give you a little bit of perspective i'm just going to come up here again up round just around the outside so there we go so there you get to see all the framework and that's like i said there is where the doors are going to be not sure if I'm going to put any windows in here yet. It may sound a bit odd, um, but I'm planning on having quite a bit of light in inside here, so sunlight doesn't like Lego. So at the moment, I'm planning not to have any windows. I might put one on this back wall here, um, but we'll have to wait and see. Okay, so that's it for obviously this weekend's work. Um, next weekend, hopefully, we're going to get all the featherboard delivered, um, which is going to be the cladding effectively for the exterior. Um, hopefully some boards to get the ceiling on as well. Um, yeah, can't think what else. I mean, there's going to be other bits and pieces as well, obviously. Um, we're going to get to a stage where I will have to get the electrics run up to here. I'm uh, obviously going to have to get the electrics run up this garden and into the leg room itself. Um, and then we will start insulating in between all these joists. Um, we'll start insulating between all the joists. Um, and then put plasterboard up obviously around all the walls and on the ceiling etc um, and then if I go down that you see we will then start to get um, start, start to get I'll put some flooring down I'm gonna put some wooden um, flooring down in there um, but yeah not that far away now um, obviously once it's all built we've got to make sure it's watertight before we start getting that precious Lego inside there but anyway what do you think of it Ethan good yeah? Yeah. It's really coming together now, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah? It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, can't wait now. It's getting quite exciting now. But anyway, so that's it for this week's update on building my Lego room. Hopefully you have enjoyed this progress. Hopefully you are enjoying this series. If you are, let me know. Let me know by number of mediums. One. Give it that thumbs up. Also down in the comments, give me some feedback. It'll be great um, to hear what you guys think um, with regards to what we are trying to achieve here in the webs household 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 <laughs> okay yep good yep right that's it guys what we got to say now see you in the next video we look forward to seeing you all in the next video bye bye everyone see ya bye for now bye <laughs>